Congress sweeps the southern state of Karnataka. CNN News 18's political editor Maria Shakil spoke exclusively to Congress MLA MB Patil. Take a look. Congratulations to you. Uh, how are you looking at your own victory and uh, the Congress party's number at 136? See, we were confident that uh, we'll, we'll get uh, 125 to 146 because uh, people will remember in the Congress government, the previous Congress government of uh, 2013 to 2018, headed by uh, Sisida Ramaya. And of course, the last four years, the misrule of uh, the BJP, uh, there was no development, not even a single house, nor any rural constituency. I repeat, any rural constituency, a single house was constructed. And uh, the corruption was rampant, you know. It was named uh, 40 percent commission Sarkara government, you know. So now uh, all the communities, uh, irrespective of the Shelkars, the Shell tribes, the Muslims, the backwards, and even the Lingais and Rokilgas, uh, all these communities have voted to the Congress and we could achieve this number. And uh, Mr. Patel, particularly about the Lingayats, there is a visible shift towards the Congress. Who do you think should be credited for it? See, what happened uh, when Virendra Patel was the PCC president in 1998-99, we got a historic 176 seats under his leadership, Alingayat, the uh, PCC president then. He was the chief, he became the chief minister. Thereafter, he has, he was to be removed because of his ill health. He was, had suffered a serious uh, health issue. He had a paralytic stroke. And when he has to be replaced, you know, there is a anti-propaganda against uh, the Congress uh, uh, party that they have removed the Virendra party. Then after they shifted to the Janta party and subsequently to the BJP. This was the time, first time now, the Lingais have decided, decided after the end of the past removal, then the Jagdish Shatter, uh, then uh, Lakshman Sodhi issues and all this. So Lingais now feel, you know, uh, BJP is no more... Uh, uh, the party of for, for Lingayas. They are using us and they had different agenda on their um, um, menu. So, you know, because there are 37 Lingayat so MLAs in, out yeah, of 136, more. are you of the opinion that there should be a representation in the government? Actually, the representation too will be there naturally. You're saying it's a natural thing? I, or? I was a major, I was yes. five years major education minister. I was a home minister. And so subsequently, other other uh, uh, issue countries, so many other ministers were from the Trishan Prakash party. Representation will be there in the, uh, the nationally for all communities. As former Home Minister, do you think you deserve to be the Deputy Chief Minister or perhaps Chief Minister now? Because, you know, let's not forget that Lingayats have voted and there is a shift that we are talking about. Mm -hmm. See, question of the Chief Minister, always the Congress party. It is a procedure that uh, the legislature party will meet. Then uh, uh, there will be um, uh, representatives from the high command. Uh, they will observe us from the high command. They will come and take the um, opinion of the MLAs and uh, report to the ASC president, now, now Malikajun Kargeji, and uh, uh, Sonia Gandhiji and Rahul Gandhiji and other senior leaders, they all together decide on the MLA's opinion and decide the chief minister. So there's nobody that uh, anybody can say that I can I want to become a chief minister or any community I want to become a chief minister. It won't happen in Congress, you know. Yes, but in terms of representation, do you think there is a need for a Lingayat chief minister or a Lingayat deputy chief minister? Naturally, Lingayats have to be given the due. Lingayats have to be given the due. So 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 other communities also, which are all there uh, who voted for us and all this. So all the communities are given to the due. So similarly, Lingayats have to be given the due. So Lingayas have, to... have to be recognized because now there's a homecoming for Lingayas to Congress. And uh, this shift, you know, has to be further consolidated in 224 elections. And uh, thereafter, the first time when Lingayas have moved, they, got, they should be given uh, a lot of uh, prominence and uh, they should ensure that uh, the Congress recognizes Lingayas.